This is Tinsley, a salty abandon, and a salty quickie. I'm in my house right now, and uh, I'm showing a picture of my current cushions. They are the original 1988 Island Packet cushions. So about a month or so ago, I decided I was going to have some new cushions made. So, and my fabric just arrived. And here is what they're going to look like now. So here's the fabric. It's kind of got a texture to it, but it's more of an updated look than this 1988 look. Uh, I ordered it from a, a nice uh, furniture store here in, in Orange Beach, Alabama. I live in Gulf Shores. Orange Beach is just the next town over. It's all kind of the same area. But uh, this is Sunbrella, so it's going to work really well on a boat. And I've got 25 yards, actually, that I ordered. And um, I got on the schedule at a place in Alberta called Peden, and they uh, will be ready to take my cushions. I have to drop my cushions and this fabric off, and they've ordered the foam for me um, on Monday. So I borrowed a truck to do that. And they have to keep the cushions for four weeks, and then it'll uh, then they'll they'll be done. So they have to keep it while they're in production. So I won't have any cushions, but that's okay. Uh, but it's going to look really nice. And in this picture, you can see where I really cleaned up the teak in the boat. Um, when I ca first came back, I couldn't get the air to work. And very quickly, it got mildewy or moldy. I'm not sure. I guess it's probably mildew. So uh, that's when I bought the Ivation dehumidifier and really cleaned up the teak. Um, so now it looks really good. And it, it wasn't looking great before the, the mildew appeared. I just didn't uh, focus on it too much, and and so I really wanted to make it look good because I saw some pictures of some other island packets with their and their teak looked much better than mine. So now this is looking much better, and so again here's the here's how it looks now the cushions. Let me see if I can get another picture here. Um, nope. Okay, you can see the cushions there. You can also see where I've, all this area, it just looks so much better. The teak everywhere looks so much better. And I used vinegar and water, a mixture of vinegar water to clean. And then I used some bleach. And then I used um, liquid pledge. Uh, no, liquid gold. Liquid gold. I'm going to use uh, this teak oil that somebody recommended for the head. Because I'm afraid the liquid gold would, you know, come off when I take a shower or something. But anyway, my boat's going to be looking pretty snazzy in about a little over four weeks once these are done. So just wanted to share that. Salty Bannon out.